Okay, so hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Adiatu here, and actually, that's on YouTube. So, in today's video, I'm coming with my first kit line up video. I'm um, sorry, I'm whispering, my son is sleeping, see if you can hear him snoring. Sorry, but yeah, so this is my first official video filmed in 2023, also in my new house. And I kind of have my plan of space almost set up, so I thought let's just film this kit lineup so I can start putting down spreads. So this year I haven't done a kit, um, a planner video, like planner lineup video yet, but I'm gonna have three planners. This planner, and then two others that I'm not showing, just because I already put the base down in this planner, so I needed to show you the kits in it. But yeah, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel before you leave and turn on the bell to be notified every single time I upload. So let's get into the kit. Okay, so here is my 2023 um, 52 weeks planner. So this is going to have fandom kits in it. So this is a cover from Print Impression. It's the SPT Print Impression Edit. And um, the planner is from OK Plans. But I'm going to do a planner video about that later on. But yeah. I don't know what I did. Okay. Um, I've already done this, but I'm just gonna show you these ones. The rest of them, I'm not gonna show you them before doing, but this week was not too bad. So, the first week from the 26th, from the 26th to the 1st, I used this, um, what's it called? Magical 50th kit from SBC, so that's that kit. And then I used some blue foil from SBC and some blue hollow foil from the Planet Pixie Co. Okay. So the next kit is from um, Fantasy Design Store. Um, the Princess kit, and I used um, silver SBC foil. I'm gonna find a doll to put here or something. I just haven't done that. But that's the second week from the second of January to the eighth. The third week is half filled in. Let me just check. This is from the Plan Pixico, and as you can see, uh, what I need is still here. So this is from the 9th of January to the 15th. I use this Cinderella like cleaning kit. I think this was her first um, exclusive art kit. And I paired it with some foil from her with blue hollow and pink hollow. This was her old foil. She doesn't have this foil bundle at the moment, I don't think. Um, yeah. So this is supposed to be a pre planner, but I'm a bit behind. Okay, the next week is the 16th of January to the 22nd. And I use this kit, which should not be here. I use this kit from, what's it called? Simply MS. I've used this before. It was the um, Princess Diary kit. I might buy it again because I heard there's a third one coming out. I paired it with some um, foil from SBC. It was the um, hollow, sparkly hollow mixed metal. And then all of these quote overlays are from Simply MS as well. So that's how this kit turned out. And then for the last week of January, I use this kit from Happy Sticker Designs. If you use my code ADIA215, you can get 15% off of my order. And then the foil bundle is from Layla Designs. So this was like the aura kit, the frozen inspired kit. And then I used this cracked ice foil from Layla Designs. And that's this spread. And then that is January, so that is my 52 weeks planner. Shout out to Avalon and Ninth for the inspiration of doing a 52 weeks planner. This year it's going to be 52 weeks of fandom in this pre planner, so I can, you know, have the fun of using all my fandom kits and do some planning by myself. I might show you the bases every month, we shall see. But yeah, let's move on to the second planner that I have, which is my filming planner. Okay, yeah, so in my filming, I obviously have not filmed any of those planning things, so I'm using this B6 print pression to um, store my kits. So, I'm just going to show you January stuff. So, in here I have my freebie from Happy Sticker Designs, which should be changing quite soon. Um, I have these moving day sampler because I did move, 
so I need to remember to use these. And then I have some foiled functional boxes here, but I'm going to move them eventually. So these um, stickers are from Simply Mess. I do have the rest of them in the back, along with the smaller sticker box, but I'm going to move them. Okay, so the first week is obviously the week of New Year's. So let me show you back here. I did not take anything out of the solos. I was not prepared. My apologies. This is the kit. It's from Caress Press. It is the New Year's Eve kit. I love this kit. It's in Premium Matte. I think I get the full kit or the one below that. I don't know. So here are the four boxes. Another extra box here. Oh, I did get the full kit because I thought I was going to need it. And then another box here. I love this because I was... So I almost fell asleep before the New Year world. And then the decor sheet. Uh, extra box with So that was the kit. Here are the extras I got. I got the tool girl with like the ginger kind of locks, which is basically what my hair looks like. Obviously my hair is not this long, but it's like an ombre colour like this. So I was excited to get this tool girl. Then I got the 15mm, do I have anything else? And then I got, oh this were the, these were the freebie boxes from um, the kit, so this one says 2024 and then this is a lighter skin tone in this box. And then I added on some character doodles from different shops, so I got this from Pink Diamond Planico because it was in the premium matte. I also got this from Apple Blossom Prints. Premium matte is different, but still premium matte. And I like these doodles, and these are neutral colours, so I can use them anytime. And then I got the SPC one, which isn't glossy, but who cares? So that was the kit. Now for the foil. So I don't think I'm going to open it, but this is the SPC um, matte bronze rose gold mixed metal kit in the sparkle pattern. I think with the new scripts, yeah, with the new scripts. So I thought that this, sorry, would look absolutely perfect. And I think it's going to be a great spread. And then I also pulled in these two fold sample boxes, a rose gold one and a matte bronze one. So that's week one. The next week is the 2nd of January to the 8th. I've had this kit for so long. So this was the SBC December 2020 mystery. I didn't, I wasn't subscribed there, but I found, I think I bought it from the buy sell trade. And then this year, I think last year she brought it back in the shop. So I was a bit upset that I didn't wait, but I have the kit, so that's all that matters. So this was the week that I closed on my house, finally after two years. But when I saw this kit, this girl sold it for me because her hair is like a lock. And it was just so cute and that was what I wanted my hair to be like at the time and now it is like that but it's just dyed. So here is the four boxes. Two more four boxes. Deco. This is a very old format obviously it's from 2020. So I'm sure it will be enough anyways. Washi strips. Does have the little things without it, but it doesn't have the patterned ones. And then bottom washi and extra box and deck covers. Ooh. Oh, I forgot it was a mystery full bit. So you get the 50mm, some pattern boxes, and then alternative skin tone for this girl. And then this is a different version of this girl. Then we get the glitter sheet and the like, label sampler. And that is that kit. So for foil I bought silver. Now that you know we've evolved I think olive would be a really good colour for this but it's a bit late now. So I just got a simple silver foil bundle from SBC. This is the twinkle format. Since it's open I'll, I will let go through it. I think this is the old twinkle format now. And then, yeah, because it doesn't have the new scripts. And then, 
this is from the advent calendar so this is the SBC Terrazzo and I just thought it would look good with this kit so I got it in silver and I also got some Terrazzo headers from Planner Hannah in silver also but let's just see is there even Terrazzo in this kit or did I just randomly think of Terrazzo there isn't any Terrazzo in the kit but I just thought it would go so because it kind of looks like paint splatters and stuff so that is the second week of January week 3 January 9th to 15th I'm using this Caress Press October Mystery 2022 and it's called Snowbound sorry for the sound I'm more scared that I'm going to wake my son up than anything okay so here is the kit the four boxes I love this coat I have this coat similar to that but in black I think I get the full version in the kit as well this box what are they making in there like a stew kind of thing another extra box and then oh, I have the extra box here the correct box I don't know if I'm going to use this one so it doesn't matter but here are the double box scenes and they all can like, make a scene with that girl and then these tall girl I love that the darker skin girl is a tall girl so I can use her I love Sadie, Sadie Papa Designs fashion girls they're all just so different then 50mm and then deco so that's the kit and um, I think I'm using it with the foil bond it came with oh yeah this is the extra box that came this was in like a shattered hollow so it's not a sparkling hollow but it basically looks like one so this is the newest oh I think these are upside down right yeah I always hold them upside down so this is the newest format for a caress press. I haven't shown that on my channel because I haven't done a haul yet. There's the bottom washi page, the scripts and icons, and then the two bougie boxes. But I have a ton of sparkly hollow underlay, so if I need more, it's fine. That's week three, and then oh, well, there's five weeks. January 16th to the 22nd, which is also Lunar New Year. I'm using another Caress Press kit. Can you tell what's my favourite kit shop? Just because of the premium matte paper, I always go to that before SBC. Unless the colourway that I want is with SBC. But yeah, so this is the Luna New Year kit. This is Kim Jess's um, Prosperity Art. I love her artwork and the colours. So here we are. We got the 15mm. I don't know why I keep talking through the kit format. These are the extra boxes. I don't know why everything is just upside down and all over the place. I'm not sure if I'm going to colour book. I think I might. We shall see. Extra fashion go there. The bottom washi. Oh, I love this outfit. It's so, it's so cute. That's that. And then I'm going to pair it with a foil bundle from... I got some doodle add-ons from Lina Designs. Then I got a foil bundle also from Lina Designs. So I got it in sparkly red. Then I got the toolbox add-on and then the foil bundle. So here is the foil bundle. I love her kids. These are the underlays. Bottom washi. Icons and scripts. And then Finally, we go into the last week, which is the week that I technically moved in to my house. But I used the moving kit already, so I thought I'd use this um, 2021 September mystery. As it was still homey vibes and it was winter, and I needed to get used. Oh. Sorry, guys. I'll be more prepared next time. So this is the kit. Oh, this kit and the moving kit I feel like 
they give me the same vibes. Let me bring that out quickly. These are like so similar in colour. And I love both of these girls. But yeah, I just feel like they give you the same vibe so it worked out. Although my house did not look anything like this, it was more of a mess. I just thought the homey vibes would work. Um, I wish my living room looked like that. I love the neutral colours. This is another kit that maybe our olive would have looked good with. This is a newer format but it's not the newest. But I'm watching, oh I love this pattern. Extra fashion girls, extra colours. Put washi. So that's the kit. And then I am paired it with this um, matte silver for your bundle from Pink Diamond Planico. It came with a mystery, I don't remember what one, but I decided against using it with that mystery. So it came with the matte sampler. I probably need to find some for these other kits, but I never did. But I will. Uh, so here is like a diamond shaped design, upside down I think probably, oh nope it wasn't, you get the bows, people complain about this bows, I understand why they complain but I'm not too fussed, it gets the job done. I wish that, I know that I like small icons but I wish they were a little bit bigger or bolder, that's my only and then the scripts were smaller, even though she did make them smaller from like back in the days when they were on like half sheets. And then two pages of bougie. So that was my January lineup. Okay. Okay, so this is my January lineup for 2023. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was my first, and you know, it'll get better and better because I haven't filmed in ages so just need to get back into the groove of things but yeah if you were listening closely you would would have heard in the beginning I said I had three planners the third one is my son's memory son's memory um keeping planner but that starts in February to February to January because he was born in February so I'm going to stop showing you the lineup for that in the February lineup but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give me a thumbs up if you liked it comment down below what you thought of this video we'll see you in the next video Bye.